hi guys it is sincerely tia marie i wanted to come on here really quick before i start driving and just give you guys a little update so i think i i don't know if i mentioned before i'm an lpn student um i attend ecpi university um in south carolina and when i tell you i'm thinking that it's similar to taking college courses it's it's intense and this is only uh the beginning let's talk about it so um my first class this semester um is anatomy and physiology amp it's known as amp and um the anatomy part is the terminology and all of those wonderful things and learning that and then um, I, it's all tied in together with the labs. So you're actually getting a vis visual to understand and learn and see. So it's intense, you guys. I feel like um, the first week I went in thinking, okay, it's like college, okay, just try to memorize it. That didn't help for me. You have to really study hard. You have to find your, the best way that you know you're able to learn and retain stuff. and and try to organize yourself to study in the best way um, in terms of, you know, your notes, making sure that those are um, organized. Um, if your professor has any lectures, you know, that's your guideline. That's the summary of the chapter, which I learned now. Before I was reading the book, not really looking at the lectures um, and then taking notes in class. But now I am reading the chapter, reviewing the lecture notes, trying to process everything and then I'll ask questions I'll write questions out which I'm gonna do a whole video about how I organize and discipline myself and my my way of studying because everyone else is different um, I'm also a visual person so I'll go on YouTube and I'll look up different videos um, that are like animated because that helps me retain the information but um, yeah a and is intense for you all of you guys that are you know are already nurses and LPNs and RNs, whatever it is. If you have any advice, leave it down in the comment section um, below. But um, if you're thinking about it, I would say go for it. Don't let any videos on YouTube, anyone discourage you, even what I'm saying. I mean, AMP is could be challenging for me, but I identified what made it to be a little challenging for me. Um, and that's that's all that counts you know i plan to go hard go hard and there's no turning back there's no room for failure um you know for me i have experience in human services got a college degree in you know that field of work i just feel my role now as a director in the field is just i'm ready to pivot and change you know into a different career path because for that i feel like in that field and no disrespect to anyone that's in the field. I love helping people in general, but human services, I mean, it's wonderful, but at the same time, you're landing a job. You know, I look at nursing as a career, um, a career that no matter what, you always have your career in nursing and it's you can continue helping people, you know? Um, so I'm excited. I'm so excited, although I'm not gonna lie, you know, my first uh, quiz, I had got a 76. ECPI requires you to get an 80, um, an 80 or higher. So when I got a 76, I'm like, what? Only a few points off, so I was discouraged. I'm not, I'm very discouraged, but you know, a few points. So now that I kinda switched around my strategies, I'm gonna do better. We'll talk again next time, you guys, later.